Hey everyone, it's Tom Trush from RightWaySolutions.com with another quick writing tip for you. Today I'm going to talk about how to get more sales by giving prospects what they want. Now not long ago, I received a call from a business owner and he was asking for my help in writing an email that would generate leads for his transportation services. Now I had a list, but most of the people on the list, they were unfamiliar with this business. In addition, he had never sent to the list before. So his plan basically was to write one email and then based on the success of that email, he would decide if he would send future emails. This approach has two major problems. The first is that it's extremely foolish to determine the success of a marketing, and I use this term loosely, strategy, because he didn't really have a strategy, but it's, it's foolish to determine the success of a marketing strategy after just one attempt. There's just way, way too many variables that can affect the outcome. Now the second thing is that this business owner, he was searching for sales without even establishing any trust or credibility with his prospects. And more importantly, he wasn't providing any value. Now when dealing with prospects, think of marketing as simply a way to give permission to begin a relationship. Now think about that again. You know, it has nothing to do with a transaction or exchanging money because that only happens after you build a bond with prospects and your relationships with these prospects they're going to expand it's going to expand as you provide more value so the beauty of this approach is you know many business owners they just ignore it they're just too impatient they're anxious for the sale and they seek that sale without any concern for relationships so by first providing value to your prospects, you're setting yourself apart from the competition. And you're also, and this is even better, you're establishing yourself as an authority in your industry. Okay, so all you gotta do is just remember, people, they don't like to be sold and they don't trust you. Okay, so now that I gave you those ideas, you know, what are some ways that you can you know, begin to provide value in your marketing strategies? Well, you know, some of the easiest are just distributing articles, reports, videos, and all you basically have to do is just address your prospects' problems, offer solutions, and then just make that information available on your website in exchange for a name and then an email address. That way you'll start building a list of prospects that you can continue to market to you know, whenever you want because they basically raised their hand and they've told you that they're interested and more information about your business because they like what you previously provided. Now also, keep in mind the two most powerful words that you can use in your marketing during a recession. Those words are how to. I mean, there are a few items more valuable right now than how to guides that target a prospect's desired outcome. Now regardless of what type of information that you decide to give away, be sure that you stress that People can have it without any risk or obligation. And don't be afraid to give away some of your best tips, tricks, and techniques. Being generous with your knowledge is only going to help you strengthen your bond with your prospects.